Hello and welcome back to the channel and welcome back to, or welcome in should I say, to a new game from this channel, Green Hell. So quite a few people are playing it. I do like the look of it, although I haven't seen too many games. Obviously I know, I know there's panthers or there's big cats that attack you and there's some interesting looking stuff. So, yeah, I haven't played, watched too many videos um, and other, of other people playing it because I want to kind of keep the surprise to myself and make it a more entertaining game that I don't know what's coming. So, there's a couple of options. There's survival and challenges. Challenges is... Um, I'm guessing you have to make stuff, build stuff, get stuff. I have no idea, but to be fair, I think it might be worth looking at survivals, the survival first. Okay, walk in the park. I'm guessing this is the difficulty. Walk in the park. Uh, sanity off, hostile tribes off, predators off, nutrient depletion slow. Well, that seemed boring. Uh, sanity on, hostile tribes on, predators on, green hell. Everything on, and then nutrient depletion increased. Well, let's go with Welcome to the Jungle difficulty. Um, yes, we've got no saves because this is all new to me. So let's click on that. And yeah, there's no music because I don't want any copyright strikes. I'm not entirely sure if I would get it, but I don't want to risk it. So it's going to be interesting to see how this game actually works and plays. As I said, I've seen it watched a few videos, but not too many. We'll see how hard this actually is. Day one. Oh, you're climbing. Okay. I'm here. Hey! I made it! <laughs> is everything all right? Yeah. You can come up. Um, you do know you have the walkie-talkie, right? Okay. Hold T to use walkie-talkie. You can come up. You can come up. Just go ahead. Mm -hmm. I need to find something in, in my backpack. Okay. I bet you want a nap. I bet you want to nap some more. I know you all too well. <laughs> oh, maldición. Can't hide anything from you. Yeah, she doesn't want to nap. Very well. You can catch up, yes? The path leads through that canyon. Mm-hmm. I know. Okay. That's T to reply. Have you tied down the boat? Oh, uh, have you tied down the boat? Jake, um, I know this might sound stupid under the circumstances, um, but I am glad we came back here. Yeah, I feel you. The yeah, place is beautiful. Still? Still, we can't forget what we came here for in the first place, I know. But as soon as we're settled in, I am off to the Jabahuaca village. And what if they will not speak to us? Come on, let's not get ahead of ourselves. You're a phenomenal interpreter. If anyone can communicate with them, it's you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Good thing I have an anthropologist at hand, Dr. Higgins. Okay, yeah. Uh, so there is someone else in here. I didn't realize there was. I wonder how much we'll actually get to interact with them after this. Ooh, a lizard. I'll probably be cooking that out for dinner later. And another one. So. Okay. Yeah, we can't kill it just yet. I don't want it to bite me, though. We've got to find a camp, apparently. So let's see if we can do that. So we're not getting ourselves lost. Hey, that looks like a camp. 
So, can we just jump down there now? Let's try and walk around. Oh, we can't run just yet. No shift. Don't want to waste any energy, I suppose. Cool Maya. Okay, I found the tent. Is everything alright? It's not a five Spacious star. Spacious interior, luxurious cots, not all that fancy. Oh, and there's a dirt floor. As long as it doesn't leak, I am fine with it. Soul Trail always delivers. At first glance, it looks like we have everything we might need. Perfecto. Don't miss the door to the tent. Well... That's everything. We're officially <gasps> settled in. You know what that means, don't you? I remember the agreement, but maybe you should... Maybe we should reconsider this. I'm not sure it's the best idea for you to visit them alone. Cariño. Um, no. You know, I have to do this. It's the only way to make them talk. Oh, don't worry. It'll be alright. Better pick up some wood. Let's have a romantic dinner. Romantic canned beans. <laughs> Use your imagination. Holy shit. Okay, run. Here we can run. Everything starts squeaking a bit more. Right, so find the tools for cutting trees. Thank you. And ops. I'll take two machetes. Why not? Let's take that off. Any more? Yes. Get firewood. Okay, can I <laughs> chop these down? <laughs> Looks like we are, slowly. Aha! Long stick. Small stick. Can we pick it up? Oh no, wait, we've... I'm guessing we've got something on our shoulders so we can't pick it up. Get firewood. Where is... I'm guessing the fire's going to be over here. Let's drop it. And pick up some more stuff. Choose a place for a fire. Another small stick, pick up that, and another machete. Right, so how are we making Oh that's a lovely inventory? We've got three machetes, some rope. Where where ah is this the craft there's the crafting menu. So what do we need? Stick no, I dropped it. Uh, craft. There we go. Choose a place for a small fire. Ah, oh, we can inspect ourselves. I, I've seen this. Yeah, we're not um not getting anything just yet. Hide armor, show armor. Yeah, I want to show armor. Okay, let's stop inspecting ourselves and... How do we... Craft with that then? Ah, there we go. Hold C and open wheel and select notebook, then select fire mark book. So let's click C. <coughs> open notebook. And yes, let's craft one of those. And um, where should we put it? Let's put it about there. So we need six small sticks. Honey, I can't seem to find a bag or two. Are you sure you brought everything? Yeah, everything the porters left. Why? Is anything missing? I'm not sure yet, uh, huh, but it feels that way. Uh, 
Okay. He seems to be missing stuff. And we also can we, we Okay, we're missing one stick apparently. I can't place it. Why can't I place the last stick? Apparently I haven't got any more small, small sticks on me. That might be why. Let's see. Let's just chop down another vine. Well, small, let's chop down another tree. That should do it. There we go. And I want a small stick. There we go. So then we need... We need some more big sticks. That's fine. We've got plenty now. That's a long stick. We don't need a long stick. We need... Big sticks. Use tool to create ember. Okay, let's use our radio first. Can you bring me the well, lighter? Looks like everything's ready. Mia, can you bring me a lighter? mentioned we seemed to be lacking some equipment oh <sighs> don't tell me yeah we have no fire ah <sighs> not a single lighter nor box of matches uh we we ordered both did you check everywhere i did you need to do it the old fashioned way well not the best start of the expedition Okay, hand drill. Let's quickly read these notes. Living in the deep interior of the Amazon, the Yabu Kayaka is one of the 80 lost tribes. One of about 80 lost tribes. Due to fear of the modern and cruel world, they mostly remain isolated. Will they welcome us? Ah, uh, they are the key and the only lead to why we're here. Okay, yep, and what about this one? Rainforest mammals, harmless. Behind all the dangers, there's still something, so much beauty within this jungle. Chapibara and armadillos, a tapir. Many small animals, many small mammals are a food source for the indigenous locals. Rich in protein and fats, they are a great complement of fruits and vegetables. Okay, and there was one more over here. Let's see what this is. The Lost Tribe. This is their land, their their heritage as it has been for thousands of ye thousands of years. Everyone who welcome who comes here needs to respect this. Hunters and Shabano. It's been 3 years since we saw them last. They often react with fear to the unknown. It's crazy, but we really need their help. Our entire plan depends on it. What plan? What are we planning? Ooh, and a undergrowth, uh, under storage, and that seems to be where the okay bugs are in the undergrowth. Cats are in the under storage. Canopy layer, nothing. There's nothing in the canopy layer. An emergent layer is where the birds and monkeys live. It's probably the safest place for them. So, craft a hand drill. Let's see if we can. And uh, nope, that's not it. Hand drill. So we need stick or uh, plank, and then small stick. Okay. So let's pick up one of those. You know what? Let's pick what pick up what we can around here. Another long stick. That's another small stick. Where'd it go? Another stick. Small stick. Okay. Let's see what we can make. 
hand drill. Hold C to open the menu and choose crafting. Crafting. Uh, drag and drop items onto the crafting table. Yep. There's that. One of those. Hand drill. Craft. There we go. Hmm. I need to find something dry. Fire tool requires tin dust. Find something dry, such as a bird nest, a fiber, or some dry leaves. That's a stick. Not very much dry at the bottom, is there? Is this a little, little gully? That's not going to be dry. That would be water. Okay. Ooh, what's this? Stick. I'll pick it up. Thinking we're going to be needing a few sticks. Another stick. Hold to take. I don't think these count as something dry. Okay, let's stop picking up rope. We don't need rope at the moment. I'll take sticks and stone. I wonder, does this count as that's a banana leaf? Okay, no. That's too big. Don't think we can use that to set fire. Ah, is this dry leaves? Wait, where is it? Dry leaf. Dry leaf. And it's, oh, it's a palm leaf. No, we don't want that. Was there another dry leaf? Yes. That's a green leaf. That's not going to help. Because green stuff doesn't burn. Or it shouldn't do. Oh, little rodents. Right. Use the fire starting tool and tinder to make fire. Use the hand drill. Open backpack tab. Use expand menu to f and fire and select tools. Expand menu. Okay, there's that. Hand drill. Use. Drag kindling from oh, drag kindling from your backpack. Ah, oh, there's a fire spot. So we put that there. Bitch. Yes, yes. Place the embers in the fire. Ignite. Ah, oh, look oh, at that. Yeah. We have created the fire. The fire is burning. Coming. Give me a minute. How do you do it? Hmm? What? You seem so calm. I am calm. I don't know how to explain it, but strangely, it feels safer here than there. Oh, I don't know. Jaguars, venomous spiders, and snakes. Let's not forget the scorpions. A <laughs> mere ant's bite hurts like hell. I am well aware of that. But still, we have a chance to achieve something. Make a difference. At home, all we could have done was be helpless and wait. I prefer the wilderness. Do you? I'll miss you. She hasn't gone yet. Oh, let's, let's see what happens when we press that. I, I love you. you. If I had known where my ambition would lead us, if I knew it would put you in danger, I wouldn't have written that damn book. Yeah. And if everyone had that attitude, there would be no scientific progress whatsoever. Don't blame yourself. There might still be time to reverse the whole thing. And I love you too, Karimi. Nonetheless, I'm a bit worried about you meeting the Yabawaka. Everything will be fine. I need to go alone. We already agreed that's the only way. Besides, they don't seem to like you. They don't seem to like outsiders. 
They shot arrows at a military chopper. Hard to blame them. Since you published your book, they've been under siege by the media, scientists, doctors. The World Health Alliance established a medical camp and probably performed research, violating the tribe's taboos. But I will convince them. I have to. <sighs> She's going alone. No, this is never good. <laughs> Rain. This is never good in a jungle. And the bed is empty. Hmm. Let's see what we got lying around. Some bars, some tuna, and a mask. Oh, we've got some more notes. Okay. Pencil. Nothing else that we can pick up. And our fire seems to have gone out and completely disappeared by the looks of things. That's fine. That is fine. Search the tent. Oh, okay. Let's check by looking at these. Uh, skull painted warriors. Mysterious painted warriors appeared yesterday on the river bank as we floated by. Who are they? Our friends, the Yabuaki? Seem afraid to talk about them. Oh. Um, this one. The biggest cat in the Americas. Jaguar. Stronger jaws than a lion. They can bite straight through the skull of their prey. Both hunts both in the forest and in the water. Nowhere is safe. Sounds good. I can't read that one. And um, what about... No, we've read the other ones. Aha! Notes. I'm at village. Call me with radio when you wake up. P.S. There's a little gift for you. Love, Maya. Hey, a watch. Hello? Hello? Mia? Hey, sleepyhead. Finally up? I am. You left already? Why didn't you wake me up? You know I hate farewells. Well, I was hoping we'd have breakfast together. You surprised me. That's all. <laughs> Admit it. You thought I forgot your birthday, didn't you? Well, I didn't. Oh, this is my birthday present then. A watch. Exactly what I wanted. It even has solar batteries. And a macro element scanner. Check yourself to see if you're not missing any. We've been here only a few days. But stress can wear you out. Tell me about it. Can we scan ourselves? Check your watch. Press F. Um, find something nutritious and eat it. So I'm guessing a chocolate bar doesn't count. Um, let's see what's over here. A protein bar. That's a little bit healthier. I'll take all of them. Can we take the cans? No. Let's eat that then. Foods. Protein bar. Eats. Right, it tells me what it gives you. I think it get. Ah, it seems to, didn't say, say that beforehand. So 25 proteins, 20 fats, and 25 carbohydrates. So, it tells you that after you've eaten it. Not bad. And my health is increasing, which is good. And I still need to eat something, apparently. So, let's do that. There we go. We're full. Oh. Well rest, well rested, and well fed. Well rested and well fed. That's what I said. Perfect. And keep it that way. We need that brain of yours working at peak performance. I'll try to take good care of it. Have you found them yet? See, si. and as expected, they don't want to talk. They behave as if I am not here. But they haven't driven you away. That's a good sign. You need to convince them that you're one of them. Mm-hmm. Agreed. That seems to be the right course of action. 
I will sleep on the edge of the village and only eat what I can find. Hmm. Brave girl. Brave girl. Thanks for the encouragement. Looks like I'm on my own from now on. We can't get in touch so often as long as I remain in the village. Been thinking the same, but didn't want to say it. I really don't want to lose touch. If anything goes wrong, I'll leave the village and get you on the radio. Otherwise, you can assume everything is just fine and there is no need to worry. <sighs> All right. Let's focus on the goal. I'll be focusing on indexing new plant species. I think I saw a few new specimen around here. Ooh. Check the cork board. Is that this cork board? Yeah, that written note I can read now. Tobacco plant leaves are great at healing venom bites. But what else can it heal? I saw this plant on the north side of the camp after climbing on a rock. There is plenty. It's a good start. Okay. Go north and find the tobacco plants. Which way is north? Ah. F's. Okay. Ah, there we go. Scroll the wheel. So that way is north. Let's go that way then. And see if we can find the tobacco plants. Oh, we have to cross the water and get wet. Oh, wet feet anyway. But then it is raining, so everywhere's going to be wet. Okay, so what does a tobacco plant look like? I did say they climb the rocks. Let's climb this rock and see what's up here. And. Okay! Oh! That's not good. The line snapped. Mia, I knew I was supposed to not call, but the line snapped and I fell down a good 30 feet. Yasmeo, are, are you okay? I'm not sure. Hold on. I'll walk away a bit so they can't hear you. Let me know once you have checked yourself. Um, check myself. It was uh, C and inspect. Nothing there. Oh, that's not good. Is there any way I can... It doesn't look like there's anything there. Nothing there. So it's just that abrasion. Okay, so I've inspected my body. No, it still wants me to do something. Ah, so I've got to do that to show it properly. Oh, that's definitely not good. Nope, I'm not in a jungle. Nothing there, and on the last leg, nothing. So it's just that. Just a scratch. Uh, it's it's all right. Nothing's broken, just scratches and bruises. Nothing to worry about. In the jungle, every scratch can be dangerous. You need to patch everything up. Do you remember how to do it? I'm pretty sure I can. Yes, I do. Mullinaria. Long, smooth, acute leaf, surrounded by yellow flowers. That's it. Okay, I'll go look for it. You should have it in your notepad. Call me when you've treated your wound. Okay. Check new wound added to your notebook. So N for notebook. Um, macro elements. Yep. So what does it mean? Nuts. Um, I'm guessing that is fats, carbs, protein, and water. So nuts are a good source of fats. Fruits are the best source of carbs. Meat is the meat is the best source of protein. And always drink safe or boiled water. Drinking unsafe water may lead to parasitic infection. 
Sanity. Effects. Hallucinations. Known treatment. Consuming an item with a natural anti-stress component increases sanity. Scratch and abrasion. Effects. Reduces condition. If untreated, it will become infected. Known treatment. Dressing cover up the wound, allowing it to heal and protect from infection. The dressing combined with a disinfecting substance will speed up the healing process. Okay, and that's it. No. Uh, aha! Bandage. So, Molinara leaf. Find Molinara plant and get its leaves to craft bandage. It says plants bookmark. You can now check the how the plant looks like. Oh, oh, fishing, spear fishing, create a bandage, just got to find the plant now, let's take a look up here, see what we can see, ah, that looks like it's yellow, is that a bird's nest, I'll take the whole bird's nest, Ah, uh, do I need a machiti? Have I got a machiti? I don't. Well, I don't have. Oh, boo! Balls. I dropped it. There we go. Can I pick him up? Oh, they, they disappeared. What? I'm guessing that wasn't the right one then. It was long, slim leaves surrounded by yellow flowers. Ah, another machete. Well, we don't need a fourth one, I don't think. Okay, so there's another one of the same. Then let's. Open up my hands. And no, nothing's doing there. Okay, this survival stuff is hard. Okay, so here is the picture of the Molinaria leaf and plants. And I'm pretty sure this is it. So let's try this again. Why is it not letting me pick anything up? Ah, it is picking them up. It's Showing me that there is some in my inventory. There we go. Damn it. Okay, so let's craft leaf bandage. And yeah. Can I craft it a bit more? No. So let's remove that. Let oh we've got the bird's nest just there. Let's see. I suppose I have to inspect myself, bring up the wounds, and there we go, drag and drop, best way of doing a lot of things, that's a lot of leaves on my arm. All wrapped Here up. I am, all wrapped up nicely. Mm. Does it hurt? Not much. I'll be a man. Um, not much. Good. Hopefully, it will heal fast. Hopefully. So, how are you doing? I'll be initiated in a few days. I am optimistic. I expect to be treated as one of their own after that. And I should be able to ask some questions then. Some elders are opposed to this, though. Luckily, Chief Kuini is on my side. Mm -hmm. Why are they opposed? I think... I think they were divided even before I joined them. The chief wanted to approach the World Health Alliance peacefully, but a few of the elders insisted on fighting. Now, the Jabahuaca basically have two factions. Oh dear. Sounds dangerous, Mia. Be careful. 
I'm not in any danger. Told you, I'm optimistic. Day 32. Jake, please come in. Jake, I need you here. Jake, please, please answer me. Mia? What happened? Mia, speak to me. Mia! What the hell's going on over there? <sighs> dum dum dum! Uh, find Mia! Well, is there anything to pick up here? Because I don't want to run out of here all crazy like. Eh, it doesn't look like there is. So let's run out of here crazy like! Oh, there you go. And we're loading. Story mode. You have completed the tutorial which is part of the story mode that will be available in the full release. The game is still in development if it features only part of Green Hell experience. Creepy Jar team hopes to, that you enjoy the game. Feel free to leave comments in the Steam forum. Press space to continue to survival modes. Okay. So, I think this is a good place to leave the game off. So, it's been it's been an interesting start. Obviously, story mode is something that we'll look at when it's available. But we're getting loads of new entries for our notebook. So, we'll go through all of that in the next video. I'm quite, I like this. It actually looks amazing, this game. Um, I was too busy engrossed in the storyline to kind of go through it but there's a lot to this game so obviously that's you can make obviously we've got some rope we've got frame bamboo frame bamboo walls a wooden doorway and door, um, bamboo doorway uh, sheds banana leaf roof or a palm roof well I might go for a banana roof be a bit more exotic but that will all be in next the next video I do for Green Hell, which I shall con continue recording for a little while. But so far, I, I am enjoying the game. It is a very interesting game. Uh, do I have any of my machetes? No, I've got to find machetes. But anyway more of the survival next time so i hope you did enjoy the video if you did remember to hit the like button and if you want to see more videos remember to hit the subscribe button but until next time have fun and enjoy the rest of your day